Yeah. What up, everybody? I'm in my aka Internet, so you can just call me X, but it's your boy. Yeah, yeah, your boy. <laughs> Yo, if you guys are wondering, my voice is all fucked, so for the rest of this week or the next couple episodes, you're gonna hear my voice all fucked. It means I get to do talking, and most of it. Behold the loudness oh, of yeah, the no. Moose King! No. Uh, no. No? No. Damn it. I was looking forward to being loud as I shit. I don't give a fuck. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. And this dusty motherfucker is the Moose King. Oh no, they know you, Dusty. Oh damn! <laughs> and we are the Dust Buddies, getting back into another glorious episode of One Piece Pirate Warriors Three. Now, guys, this might just be it. We're getting into the last uh, Legend Log episode thingy of yeah. fucking One Piece. Now, for those of you who don't know, for those of you who already know, for those of you who've seen the little snippets, we've already got a game plan to come after this. We're not gonna tell you just yet. You're gonna have to wait and see. Oh, we'll put a link to it in the description. Hey, you know, it happens, right? But it's gonna be fancy. It's gonna be anime, and it's gonna be absolutely delicious. Losing my voice does not stop me from having my sake. Ah, nothing like a sip of sake to start the day there, brother. So let's say we do this last stage in fucking style. How do we go out in style? By me being Pirate King. Excellent, and I will be the greatest goddamn cook in the sea. Oh, why is he flicking me off? Wrong finger, Law! Jesus. Oh, you could be Law if you want. Yeah, but who wants to be Law? Let's be A honest. lot of people love Yeah, a lot of people love Law. Like, especially post time skip Law. He's pretty fucking cool. I can't lie. Me? I'm good. I'll be the cook. I'll, you know, kick shit in the face. Grill flambe it. Fucking not like it. devil shambango. You, if you're going out, you go through as Moss Head, bro. No, why would I go through as Moss Head and play your character? I'm gonna play my guy. No, yeah, your guy's be amazing. Law. But Law's only level one. I ain't wasting shit on that. Yeah. Hello! It's the last episode. It is. That's why I'm going out on a high note. No, you should be going out on a high note for what's his name? Whitebeard? You're right, but no. we don't have him wait, right now. Wait, wait, wait. God damn it. Exactly. All has been sacrificed. Ah. You don't even know what he said. Orewa Sunday Sanji. No. Sing Jai Zoyo No. Ka? Ow. Oh, no ka. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, right. Ah, oh, fuck, brother. How do you feel? And this is why you should have picked Law, because it was Luffy and Law against the. Uh, what's his name? The Flamingo. Yeah. Which means we could have got the special cutscene. But, more importantly. The new, uh, what do you call it? The new chapter came out, didn't it? Oh, yeah, the new chapter did come out. Yeah, 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 yeah. They introduced, um, they introduced the, the commanders of the Revolutionary Army. Ooh, now that's a big fucking dizzle. Yeah, as yeah. the kids say, it is a huge dizzle. Behold. Nobody says that, do they? It's just me? I'm getting old? Yeah, you're getting old. Oh, Jesus. I'm gonna be Frankie! Yeah, I'm cool with getting old! Getting old sounds great. God. It's like being an elder, only not quite a dragon. Oh, we should tell him about D&D adventures! Yeah! I haven't really had an adventure yet. Well, you're, you almost did. I almost died. And I just got there. <laughs> so guys, check this out. Let me give you a little update on some D&D shit. Why are we watching this? I wanna kill things. I haven't seen it. Yes, you have. You have. Oh, you have. I'm so sorry, brother. Fuck you. I'm so sorry. No, fuck you. I'm so sorry. Hooray! So let me tell you my D&D &D adventure. Check this shit out. Post the death of Malagok, the half-orc, we have been introduced to a little man by the name of Scruffy. Now, Scruffy, he's exactly what he sounds like. Scruffy talks in the third person. Scruffy is a very smart man. Scruffy is a former adventurer who has come back to be an adventurer. Scruffy's an idiot who keeps talking in third person like he's somebody. Scruffy he's not. is the main character of his own story. That's right. He's the main character of no story. He's yes. There is no story that doesn't involve Scruffy. You're right, brother. Thank you for that. I needed that confidence boost. Yeah. No. The only thing to keep me going in life is confidence. That had nothing to do with what I was saying. It's got everything to do with eggs. No. No. What the hell? What, what what does eggs have to do with anything? Egg. That's actually that's actually the uh, the point of it. The uh, it, like you know how I always say, oh, what does that got to do with the price of eggs? So guys. <laughs> so we're gonna kill things, and things are gonna die, and 
During these tough battles, we can unleash a unique attack, and if they start preparing attack, move out of the attack range. I mean, I shit. tried my hand at uh, the whole D and D thing. It's not that bad. It just takes a lot of imagination. Well, hell yeah, and it is a huge investment of time. I mean, we spent like what, like half the day, almost all the day, pretty much the entire day there. You know what I mean? Like, it was an adventure. It was pretty fun. It was my first time. So, well, first time there. I tried D and D before. Right. With uh, what's his name? Uh, a friend of ours called the Archiver. Right, right, right. His family, but, uh, right. That's right. We haven't done that in forever, so. God, yeah. But, I mean, granted, that was also a one-off episode too. Like, this this is gonna be a campaign. Like, well, okay, it's technically a late game campaign, right? We're all kind of level 18 at this point, and the only reason I made Scruffy is because obviously Maligar died, so I had to, you know, compensate for that, and, you know, not be dead essentially, so I could help the. T so we brought Scruffy in, and I have I have played a little bit of D&D, only for like a few years. I've only explored Barbarians, Rangers, and this would be my first time playing a Druid. And I'm going with the, for those of you who know d and I'm going with the Unearthed Arcana's version. Just like you guys know, all this shit is going over my head. I'm going for the Unearthed Arcana version of the Druid, and I'm going with the Circle of the Shepherd. Which is essentially a more healing-focused druid. Um, I do obviously still have all the good bodily functions that come with being a UA druid, so timeless body, uh, wild shape, and I just got my level 9 spells so I can do shape change now and become a goddamn dragon! Because shape change is really fucking cool and anything you've seen you can become, regardless of the... Well, not regardless, but it has to have a... What was it? A rating of either your level plus your constitution modifier or less. So I became an adult black dragon. When when Scruffy Scruffy was a plant. Scruffy was treated like a plant. And uh, we were fighting some earth elementals. And Scruffy embraced his inner plant and, you know, got buried ten feet underground by a giant earth elemental who smacked the shit out of him. And like a real plant, I grew. Like both. And became a dragon. Both. When in doubt, always be a dragon. Right, brother? Yeah. So I can be an adult dragon. Uh, you know, we look through the monster manual to kind of get an idea and things like that. And all that's really made me want to do is focus on being a druid from the beginning. Like, could you imagine the entire list of monsters? Everything your DM is throwing at you, you've seen. So, like, if you can match the critical rating, you're like, Ooh, I will become you. <laughs> It's the way you did that. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Pirate Captain is fucking Donkey Dead. No, wait, I missed. Wait, hold on. Donkey Dead. Oh, wait. He lost head. Head. Strike. Okay. Um, God. So, yeah. Scruffy, Scruffy is awesome. And I love being a druid, and it's a lot of fucking fun so far. I can't lie. So I, I want to figure out what, you know, what we're going to do with it, because when I play d and I'm more of a role-playing focused kind of guy. You know, I get the stats, I get maximizing it, and essentially breaking your poor DM's campaign. But by the same token, it's like, there's so much fun to be had when you just kind of get into the character, right, brother? Like, you just embrace everything about him, it's like, I am this guy, regardless of who he is. And, which kind of sucks for me, because I actually, I, I rolled some pretty fucked up stats. I am a noble but I am one of those asshole nobles. Like, it is bad. Like, my flaw is quite literally, quote unquote, why yes, the world does in fact revolve around me. And I'm like, oh my god, if there's ever been a time to dip into my condescension, now is the time! And I embraced my inner deeper asshole. I dug deep, pulled out my large intestines, and became the greatest asshole I could put forth. And it's been fun! I pissed off one of our main characters, well not our main character, but one of our group's characters already by accidentally calling her a slave when I first met her. Um, I mistook one of our, our, he's, what is he, a paladin. I mistook our paladin for a servant. It's been good. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. I, I, all this, I'm not good with all that, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk, bro. No, of course, of course, I understand. Like, I, understand. I just started with Shy, and I, I don't know that. Yeah. I'll get it eventually. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. That deep, all you need to know... <laughs> All you need to know for D&D is that dice shaming is a real goddamn thing. Fuck every dice that has ever fucked me over, ever. Uh, I'm usually pretty good at rolling <laughs> dice. No, totally, but it's like, you'll have those days where, like, the dice just does not fucking work with you. Like, even on even on Saturday. 
My dice, the one I, I gave you, the uh, the orange one to roll? That thing gave me nothing but fucking 11s the whole goddamn time. You can't do a goddamn thing with an 11. That's like halfway. It's like, what am I going to do with this? Be just passable? Why? Who the hell? Why? No. Fuck that noise. Give me a 19. Now that I can fucking work with. No, because that's almost a 20. Why would they want to give you that? Exactly. Now we're going to give it to uh, our, our guy who plays uh, a character named Hyperion. He's got this really fucking wicked ability that any time he hits a 19, he treats it as a crit. So, like, he's got two chances to hit a fucking crit on a d20. What the like, hell's uh, a crit? A crit basically means, especially in combat, uh, any time you roll a 20, it's an automatic crit, which means you do, do double damage. What is that? A crit? A critical. Oh. Yeah. So you said, I, I, can, I understand that. That's crit. true. I should have just fucking said critical. Why am I being so smart today? <gasps> she, no, 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 it's here. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> Wait, we have to at least get to his laugh. No, Sanji. Oh, he ain't uh, laughing. No, he's gonna laugh. Look at his mouth. It's wide open. Damn it. Go away, don't let me go. Shilolo lolo lolo. Come forth, Shilolo lolo. Oh. Shilolo no. <laughs> oh, right, Fujitora. Brother, I have no idea. What the fuck is a Fujitora? <laughs> what the fuck is a Fujitora? Him, he's a blind guy. Well, I'm glad we narrowed that down, but like... What? I, I think they either call him the White Tiger or Purple Tiger or some shit. Ah, oh, okay. So he's like an Admiral level kind of power level kind of thing? Yeah, he's, a, he's an Admiral. Oh, he's one of the new Admirals we got. Oh, so fuck him and all the fucking swords he's he wrote in. He's one of the ones who replaced uh, Akainu and... Uh, Aokiji! And right, right, right! But he's blind as a dick to the point to where he's leading around his fucking game. But I'll bet you he'll fucking stab you in your dick, won't he? Yeah. Well, shit. But, 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 uh, the worst part is he did that to himself. Wait, what? Yeah. He fucking scut- Why? What? No! What? Why are we so stupid? Look at he Lost said, He said he blinded himself because he, uh, he was tired of seeing all the horrors of the world. Oh, damn. That got dark. I love it! I love it! It's good. It's a good name. Oh! That's right! He does gravity things with his blade! And the things come down in us. Hey, look, it's planetary devastation. <laughs> Five bucks says it's the same goddamn model that they used it in their other game. Utilizing assets, reutilizing assets. Woo, Bandai. Woo, Bandai. <laughs> uh, he chopped it up into blocks, just increasing the amount of damage it's going to do to the vaulting area. That's smart. Fujitora's like, no, I brought this bitch down. I'm gonna put this bitch to rest. And it is sleeping. 10 out of 10. What? Funny fact, Dress Rose is supposed to be based off Spain. Really? Dress? Oh, wow. Okay. I dig that. I dig that. So I'm guessing he pictured Dolph Lamingo as a Spanish guy. That would make sense, wouldn't it? Huh. Why is that gonna make sense? I was hoping you'd find something to back me up on that. I threw that out there with like, yeah, he's got something for this. He's totally got me. And then he calls me on my shit and I'm like, I don't know what to do. I just went with it. Nah, I didn't expect it to go this far. The only reason why I say it's Spain is because they have this character. Right. And she has a flower in her hair. And the way she has the flower in her hair right. is representative of like the, the classic... You know, Senorita with the rose in her hair. Oh, no shit. Like, like a real classic sort of novella, Senorita? Yeah. Oh, no shit. Okay. Why am I fighting Fujitora and Doflamingo? Wouldn't that make Oda the racist? Yeah! <laughs> yeah, Oda! How dare you say things and be resauced? I'm not calling Oda racist. No. He's resauced. He's not racist. Oh. No. no, no, no. He's got quite a diverse crowd going on here. I mean, he's got this white guy. He's got that white guy. The only black guy we know on our main team is dead. But hey, you know, he's not racist. That's not true. Usopp's from Africa, remember? And he's a coward. He's the weakest member on the group. He's still strong because it's the bucket straw hats. Take that. All on a float. Take that. No. No? No. Just I was no. trying to be relevant no. to the current culture of mainstream. What do you mean current? That shit's old as shit. Exactly. It is current to the relevant mores of mainstream. No. Everyone no, loves no, nostalgia. No. It's a goddamn pacifista! <laughs> My apologies, brother. 
good. I made a girl. Oh shit! Don't flip me into a flea. Oh no! Wait, that's a uh, bounceman. Oh shit, brother! We've got to help them not die. I'm gonna go help them not die. Shilo lo lo. Brother Zoro's about to retreat. Poor Mosshead can't handle his own. Oh, he can't handle his own, but you won't help him. Sanji's doing alright. He's right next to him and he's surviving just fine. Yeah, because you're playing as a... No, the other Sanji. Not me, Sanji. The real Sanji. The Sanji that I wish we could all be. That everyone deserves to be. I knew you were a fake. What? No, I'm not a fake. Oh, you mean Sanji? He's not a fake. I am a Don Flamingo clone. Oh, wait. Zoro's not trying to flee. What the hell is that? Yeah, because I came back and brought him help. I ran into a circle and he was like, Oh, save me, Sanji! And I gave him health. And here you we did are. nothing. I did everything of the sort. Are you going to steal my kills? I see you. I'm running through. I see you. Oh, you almost stole my kills. <laughs> not almost. No, no, no. Oh, I got him. I got him. Oh, no. Who got him? Ah, oh, God damn it. Okay. I was like, let me let me go to the burning state. I'm going to treat. I'm going to take this shit and no. No, damn it. Son of a dick. Oh fuck! You're not Manny. wrong. Son of a dick. Yeah. Oh, that—that that is true. That, yeah, that, that technically makes more sense, doesn't it? And it's less insulting. Son of a dick! Yada 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 yada! And I got three people out. Three people. Woo! Look at them exclamation points. Why am I locked onto somebody that I didn't? Want? Oh god, it's a marine commander. Kizaru has started a laser attack. He's gonna focus on the lasers. Why is Kizaru even here? I, uh, you know, a uh, Dressrosa fake arc. Oh uh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Right, yeah, right, right. This is this is before Dressrosa was actually a thing. All right. Now that's all dead, and that's all right, and I'm gonna get me a light bright. I like light brights. You don't like light brights? No. Why? Those things are amazing. Light bright, making things with light. <laughs> I swear to God, if I get to the other side and that door appears to be blocked too, I'm gonna be so mad. So goddamn mad. I will have run all the way the fuck over here for nothing. Prepare yourself. The nothingness has come. God damn it! It has come. And now I return to the battle. Slowly. Oh wait, I have to change my tie. Uh, is it this one? Yeah, there we go. I had to tighten my tie. There we go. Oh shit, Sanji, no, San get good! Sanji, get good! What are you doing, real Sanji? I had to save his ass. Fake Sanji is doing better than real Sanji. Like little what kind of shit is this? It's all right. Mosshead went down first, so hey, everything it, it, afterward is just showing how much longer Sanji was able to last. No. Yep. No. That is how the statistics of life. That work. just shows you how much Sanji was doing nothing. Oh my God. He was he was standing off to the side. It was Mosshead who truly sat in the middle of the fray. Yes. There can only be one. Marine Commander, get your fucking out! Don't punch me, you fucking dick. Sanji, get my ass over here and do something. There I am. Uh, what am I doing? What, what was I doing? Alright! Shield Grotto Bin Byakut Grill Shokto! Law. Fucking it. Law. I'm over here. Why would you put. Law, Jesus Christ, man! Stop stealing my kills, you bitch! Good job, Law. That's alright. Law's on my team now. Shokto! Can't go! In the. Don't put that, that bitch. bitch! There you go. I was waiting for it. Gamu Gamu no! Jet the Hakko! To all you Hawk fans out there, sports. Haha, <laughs> aren't they something? I don't know sports at all. Brother, do you know sports so we can make fun of a team? You know sports. No, I don't know sports. Why? Why do you want to create enemies? I don't know! Haters are my favorite! They're like Haterade, they're delicious, they fill me up. Give me something to focus on. <laughs> well, I don't know! Hey, I leveled up! Fantastic! Look at that shit! Where is that commander at? Oh, the leader's here! Let's kick his dick in! Gamu Gamu no! Hey, Sanji Foot! Whee! He's dead! Because I've got four fucking people coming in with the exclamation point, so everybody and their mother is fucking dead. Also, speaking of which, happy Mother's Day to anybody, because it's Mother's Day for us, even though you guys haven't seen it. Yeah. Right? It's our- Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Right? I mean, you know, it'll be like three weeks before you see this. So we're late, but we're not late, because we were smart, and we filmed this on Mother's Day. Damn. 
Yeah, hey there, bitch. We're so committed. We, we yeah. abandoned our mothers. For yeah, this. right? Oh, Happy God. Mother's Day. What are you guys doing today? We're filming. Well, my mom's at work, so I can't really do much. So I, I gave her this morning to, you know, enjoy. Hubba hubba da, puppy power! And if you're buying for your gift at this time, which is like in the afternoon, you're a piece of shit. Yeah, right? Yeah, seriously, you're, you're fuck those people, piece man. Of shit. Fuck those last minute fucking people. I, I mean, I, I could get it like the day before or maybe in the morning yeah. of, but in the afternoon, bro. Exactly, like the day's already fucking gone, dude. Like, what are you doing? Unless you're like taking her out to dinner or something, like you pre planned this shit? No, fuck you. <laughs> Hooray! Straw Hat! Don Flamingo said he wants to talk to you! Oh my god, Don Flamingo said, ha ha ha! Mingo, what do you mean? Just listen! Ace is no, flame no, no, flame no, 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 no. At, the, at the end of the day, I don't want to hear no more. How's the bad guy, pussy? Hey, we're back in the fight! Thanks, brother! Gamu 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 no daisu geku! Gee, thanks, Law. You're welcome! You're not Law. Aww. But you should have been. <laughs> you could have been law. You could have been law. <laughs> Obviously, this is a trap. Thanks, law. Obtain the flame flame fruit by kicking the flame flame out of flame mingo. Hey. You know what I love the most about this? What? We. It's like we already know that it's a trap. And it's like fuck it, let's go to the trap. Hell yeah, exactly right. But isn't that just Luffy in a fucking nutshell? Hey, this is a trap. I don't care. I'm gonna go rescue my friends. Oh. All right, Luffy. Good luck. Oh no, Luffy's been captured! Luffy broke free? How the fuck did he do it? Raw strength and a knockabout. <laughs> oh fuck. Pirate captains have appeared and are targeting the flame flame frog. She, she, she. She, yeah! She, lo, lo, lo! Count I knew it! I knew it! I detected your savagery from a mile away and returned by insulting myself. I don't, I don't know where I was going with that, but here we are! Pirate <laughs> Captain, down. Oh, let's punch him! Let's punch him! I don't care! I super don't care! Sad face! But nevertheless, guys! Brush that dust. Off your shoulders. What a shot dust of that beautiful ass subscribe button. If you like what we do here, leave a like on this video. Leave a comment down in the comment section. What has been your favorite part of One Piece up until this point, guys? We've only got maybe one more episode to go. So start telling us now what you've been looking forward to this entire time. Give that bell a little riddling so you always know when our video goes live. And make sure you share this out to everyone you've ever met and everyone you've never met. But brother, how do they do that? They want their phones. Right. And look up on D Type of thing. S S T Budneys. Right. Search. Hey, look, there's our channel. Look at that. What does that little red button do? And then you go, look, 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 bang, I want you to fucking subscribe to these guys. Well, goddamn, if I'll be. And if you absolutely love what we do here, drop us a tip on Patreon. We really fucking appreciate it. It helps us improve the show and keep everything going till, you know, we're fucking done it all. But we will see you guys in the next episode. Uh, Peace. Bye, bitches.